Hello everybody, my name is Taslin Gauz and in this video I'll teach you guys how to create text. This video will be divided into two parts. In the first part I will show you guys how to make the text in Cinema 4D and then we'll import that text in Photoshop and we'll add all the cool effects to make it look 10 times better. So uh, if you guys have Cinema 4D and Photoshop then this video is gonna be a great video for you guys or, or a great video to learn how to make text. So let's get started. A beginner's tutorial, but I will not show you guys the basics of Cinema 4D. You guys should know how to move around within the software. And um, yeah, that's really it. That's all you guys want to know, and the rest you guys can follow along. So, the first thing first you guys want to do is go ahead and click on Mo Graph from there, go to, uh, down to Mo Text. Once you guys are uh, there, all you guys want to do is replace the text with pretty much whatever you guys want. So, I'm just going to go ahead and type in my name. So, just like that, bleep. And there you go. That is it. Goodbye. I'm gonna go ahead and pick a font. You guys can change the font pretty much to any font you guys like. I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna go for. Anyways, so of course you guys might have a better font choice than me, but that's what I'm gonna pick for. It's not the greatest font, but it'll work. Now you guys can set the depth to any uh, you guys want. I'm just gonna set it to 40. Uh, I think that looks better. You guys can just play around depending on your text. It basically adds the depth to the character uh, to the text. I feel like pretty self-explanatory anyways i'm gonna go to click on caps after this case when you click on caps from there click on fill a cap and then set start and then to fill a cap and then set the steps to 10 and set your radius to 5 and then steps the uh, set the steps to 10 and this is what your text should look like it doesn't look crazy uh what if i change this to 2 oh yeah i actually said that i said the radius to 3 and uh, I'm just gonna set the radius to 3 so this is how your text should look like you just need to copy these settings uh, once you guys are done copying these settings all you guys want to do is press ctrl C and while selecting your while your text is selected and press ctrl V now you should have two layers uh, of the text of the same text now you just want to click on the uh, original layer okay make sure your original layer is selected while your original layer is selected change your steps to 20 and change your radius to 11 then change your steps to 20 and then your radius to 11 and this is what your text should look like now if you just hold the blue arrow and move it backwards this it it will create this outline which makes your text 10 times look better so uh which should make basically makes your text look better so i'm just gonna move that uh around i feel like that looks pretty good uh maybe a little around that so yeah that's that looks pretty good now we'll be creating materials and giving this these this text some color so to do that all you guys want to do is go down here and click on create from there go to new material and then from there you want to set uh, i'm gonna set it to black it's for the back thingy whatever you guys want to call uh for the outer text and i'm gonna create a new material and i'm gonna change it to purple looks good uh so i'm just gonna put purple right there and i feel like that looks really okay for now it looks okay later obviously we're gonna be playing around in photoshop so what you guys want to do is you guys want to go ahead and select these both text text layers and you guys want to press ctrl c now you guys will need to go ahead click the link in the description down below and download a lightroom so once you guys are done downloading that lightroom you guys want to click on file then click on open and locate that lightroom and then click on that lightroom this is the lightroom which will be uh linked down below so you only guys want to do is click on ok and this is what it should look like this is an old this is an old text i was working on you guys can just select it and delete it it doesn't really matter uh now uh you'll be in this lightroom and all you guys want to do is press ctrl v while your text are selected and bring it in around and you just bring your text in the middle and uh, this is what everything should look like um yeah i guess this is what it should look like don't mess around with the lights they are perfect i guess so yes now uh, to uh, make sure your camera is selected so if you click this you're out of camera uh, you're not using your camera don't do that make sure you select this uh, and then use your camera and then uh, try to position the camera so try to position it however you guys want I'm just gonna try to position it in the middle just in case you guys forgot to copy the text all you guys want to do to go back is click on windows and there should be your old text you guys were working on so don't get worried if you guys accidentally forgot to save this or whatever uh, I'm just gonna go to back and I'm just gonna try to position uh, position this in the middle and I, I feel like this is quite good honestly it's it's uh, I feel like this is okay that's really it try 
to position this in the middle yeah i'm just gonna go with this i feel like this looks uh, okay so all you have to do to render your text is click on this render to picture view and this is gonna be the second option in these weird windows thingy and you, uh, all you guys want to do is click on that and it should start rendering your text and uh i'll be back once it is done <laughs> So the render is done and to save your render all you guys want to do is click on file and then click on save as change the depth to 16 bit this part is not important but you guys can change it and then click on ok and you guys can just click on save and that's really it that's how you guys make a text 3d text in cinema 4d now i'm going to be creating one more video really soon on how to add effects to this text and make this text look 10 times better so definitely watch that video if you guys have watched and followed this video uh it's going to be out probably in a few hours uh but when you're watching this video, it should be out. Anyways, uh, my name is Daz, and I'm signing out.